Cutting weight. How are you guys doing today? This is Sam with Boxing Strength TV. Today we're going to be talking about cutting weight. Now, most people that watch this channel, you know, they're amateur fighters in Africa, uh, fighting in the amateurs, uh, three three-minute rounds or three two-minute rounds. So should you guys cut weight for a fight? Now, a quick answer is no. Don't do it. You know, nothing more than five pounds over or under. Don't try to cut too much. Don't try to bulk up too much for a fight. Now, the reason is you guys don't have that much time to recover. You don't have that much time to rehydrate yourself after the weigh-in. So what that does is that when you go fight, you're going to feel weak. You're going to feel dehydrated. You're going to get, when you get hit, you're going to get hurt easier because there's a, there's a fluid in your brain that helps protect your brain. So when you get hit and you don't have that much fluid because you're dehydrated, every hit is going to magnify. You're going to get hurt a lot easier. You can even get knocked out a lot easier. So cutting weight for an amateur fight is really a mistake. You shouldn't do it. Just try to get us in shape as healthy as possible get into your natural weight where you feel strong you feel healthy and you just feel like you belong to that weight class and you stay there don't cut you don't go up unless you naturally grow up because you're a younger guy and you just go up in weight naturally then that's okay but you just stay at that weight until you until you just you just fight at that weight that's it you know you don't try to cut you don't try to bulk up Get into that weight, get in shape, and you just fight. Don't worry about cutting weight if you're an amateur fighter because you just don't have that much time to cut weight. You don't have that time. But for professionals, if you have that one day, that's good. Maybe you can cut a little bit more weight. But if you don't have the team, you don't, you don't have the knowledge of nutrition, of rehydrating your body, then try to learn that. Try to read books about it. Try to talk to coaches who really know what they're talking about. Now, this is, this is the issue. I would suggest reading books than talking to coaches, honestly, because everybody, nowadays, nobody tells you I don't know. You ask somebody something, they'll tell you something. Doesn't mean it's true. Most likely, it's going to be false information. It's not true. So I would suggest reading something reputable, some, some good source, something where you, you trust the information, not, not your coach next door, okay? Because most likely, they're going to tell you some old school method that's going to fuck you up in the long term. So really be careful of where you're getting your information from. And I'm telling you here, guys, that cutting weight for an amateur fight or even a pro fight, if you overdo it, if you overdo it for a pro fight, it's bad for you. Your performance will go down and you just, you just won't perform as well. Now, I've done that once for my last fight. I've cut too much weight. Uh, I, I was not able to rehydrate in time because it was an amateur fight. And I performed very poorly. You know, even though I got knocked down, I was still able to win the fight, but I felt very weak. I felt like I was just drunk or something and during the fight. So I believe that was because of cutting weight. Because I just felt I just felt weird. Like I just didn't feel like myself the whole day. I was paranoid, I was just going crazy. I just felt like my stomach was empty and I just even no matter how much I ate, and I couldn't eat much because I was really nauseous. It just wasn't a good deal for me. So don't cut too much weight, guys. Just get in shape and fight. That's it. Don't worry about anything else. Don't listen to people tell you, oh, you need to cut down so you have your longer reach on the smaller guys. That's bullshit. The smaller guys will fuck you up because they're gonna be stronger and healthier than you. You know, cut, cut enough weight, you won't be able to walk properly, let alone fight. So don't listen to that shit. Just get in shape and you will do well. Thank you, guys. You have a great day.